All right, everyone. It's Triple Fork Artifacts. Uh, how y'all doing today? I got a few things to show here tonight. I got a pretty good bit of petrified wood here to show off a little bit tonight. Some of it's sold, some of it ain't. Okay, right here I've got like a quartz. It looks like it might have been like a polisher or a crusher or some kind right here on that end right there. Got a little groove in it right here for your thumb to hold on to. Pretty little artifact. Here's another one that's been chipped out. Like a crusher. Uh, I think this is one of the petrified wood stones right here. Right here. Like a polisher or crusher. It's got a little indent in it right there. Like it might have been sort of a nut and stone maybe. But it could have been just a crusher. Like a, a nut crushing stone. It's got quartz running through it right here. So fine. That's that. It was probably a crushing stone of some kind. It's like this one right here. Now it could have been a polisher, but it's a little coarse. It's got ridges in it, not real bad, but it's, it's pretty smooth. And chipped out up here, probably for a holding mount. Could have been a crusher on this end too. Or like this right here. Just cr crushed down with it. Right here is a, I'd probably say a scraper. It's the edge of the blade right there. It's pretty good, pretty fine edge right there. A little bit thicker up here. So it might have had a finger joint right there. You can see maybe for scraping. This one here. I was thinking that might have been petrified wood, but it's got like a fine cutting edge right here and it's been broke off right here and broke off up here and up here it's got a worked end on it down here so right here's a piece of petrified wood probably say a crusher or a grinder of some kind. Shoot that up on this end. Now there's another piece. Probably say that was specified. And worked on this end up here and down here too. I'd say it's pretty famous things here. Another piece of petrified. It worked out right there for some reason. I don't know what they could have used this for. It's maybe a scraper because it does have a little bit of an edge on it right there. Something like that right there maybe. Finger go right, sorry about that, finger go right in the joint right here. Work like it right there. And another piece of pitch bud. See what's been worked on down here. And another piece. Almost looks like it was like a start of a drill, maybe. Or might have been at one time broke and then started using for something else. And another piece right here. You see the grains running up to it and busted down and through here. Maybe a little bit of iron in it. 
probably a chip off or something. Right here's a piece. Real fine piece. Looks like it might have picked your finger right there. Tip the indention. Might have been like a fine grinder of some kind. Right in there. So it's sunk in. This side here is pretty flat. Okay, here's another piece. If you bring one to it. Yeah, another one right here. Okay, this might have been a polisher, maybe. Ran it on this up around here and pretty much flat on this side. It's got a beveled edge all the way around it except for down this side right here. Round it off right here. And another piece. See the grain in it pretty well and it's pretty flat down in here. Maybe for a fine or a crush or some kind. It's rounded off up here. This piece right here. See those flat and then polished right there. And chipped off right here. Okay. This looks like it might have been quartz right here. It's been smoothed off right there, but it's that angle in this court right here's got a little hump in it right there. Another piece of petrified. See the bark in it. Very much nice bark with the grain. Just been worked on that end. And this one right here. And another piece. And worked up here, and that's a little quartz right there. Feels almost like sandpaper in the way. And then worked on this end. Here's a pretty little piece right here. Look in the light here so you can see if you see it good. I'm going to put the on it. See if the rig is in it. This side over here. Damn, busting. I don't know what they could have used it for, but... Okay. See grain in that. That's fine. There's another one. It's been flattened up here. That's that one that had the quartz in it. Sorry about that. There's another one. Quartz. I mean not quartz, but petrified. Pretty smooth up there. You can see what's definitely been worked down here. I'm doubting or debating whether or not this is petrified or not. It kind of looks like it is. It looks like it's got the grain in it of a tree. But I'm not positive about that. You just wave the judgment. Here's another piece. It's like a big cannonball on the same way, but it's got an edge on it up here. Flat right there. This side's got an edge on it right here. It's been busted right here, but it's flattened out and chipped out in the angle. Maybe broke off or something. It's got a little bit of quartz in down inside of it right here. Here's an awesome right here. Looks like that might have been a blade at one time right there. Maybe a scraper because it 
put your finger across right here and I mean it fits in there perfect. You got a place for your thumb right there, you can see that little spot right there. Put your thumb in there right there. And your finger right here on the other side where you see that indention right there where I move my finger. Maybe a scraper of some kind. That's another pretty piece and work definitely. See the oil stain there and up here now. Good and flat right there, it's like a little indention. Like your thumb or something fit in there, your finger. Make your finger fit down this side right there because you can see the oil stain right there. And I got a couple little ones right here. Then shift right there. And that's been polished right there. That looks like that might have been part of the tree then maybe. It looks like it was used for something that's cut out and smooth. Looks like she's got an edge on it right here, maybe a part of a blade or a scraper. And busted on this side here. That's been busted on it. this whole side right here, it's been chipped right now. It's flat, but it never was polished or nothing like that. Maybe an effigy where they started on something, just didn't finish it. Another piece of quartz. So it's been worked on that end, smooth and polished. It's been busted on this whole side right here. Okay. Now here's another one, just like this one right here. That looks like it might have been blade at one time. Or maybe like on a spear rod or something like that. It's hard to tell. And right here's one that Perry found. Now, you all can see that looks like the ridge of a pot. Like a piece of pottery. It's been fire burn on this side here. Perry was thinking this might have been the inside. I told him if it was, they, when they made the pot, they had it in a straw mold. And they might have baked it from the inside. It's got a little bit of burn on this side. And it's pretty smooth, especially up here. Looks like it's rough texture, but it, it might be a little rough, but it, it's, it's real smooth. The whole stone is. That, that's a pretty artifact right there, though. And here's something else I found on the river. M-A-N-49-S M-T-M dash nine blank two oh seven and I don't know what that could have went to it was in a lot worse condition when I found it I cleaned it up pretty good so I'd bring it home and let's put it on video that's all I've got for today and uh, any of y'all get hungry, always go to Bojangles, Miller Creek. We'll take care of you. Give you pretty much anything you need that we have. And uh, y'all have a good day. And I appreciate all my viewers. Appreciate any new subscribers. And I appreciate the subscribers I do have. And I'll have another one out for you tomorrow. Y'all have a good one.